Hey guys and gals, this is the Homestead Prepper and this is uh, another rocket stove that I've built here for like a proof of concept. And I um, have it to a rolling boil and I put the, uh, the international standard they say is 5 liters of water which is about 1.32 gallons, say a gallon and a third. And um, it, uh, it's doing it and I found that it works better with less wood in the firebox than more wood. More air you can get in there with that fuel, the better it seems to work. And the proof is in the pudding. And guys, I didn't use a skirt on that to get it like that. I did have the lid on it for a while. This is actually for another project that I'm working on right here, but that's for something else. But you can see it is working, and I was uh, really motivated to get this to work. Um, boy, that is a raging bull right there. Because uh, I read a website, another uh, a competitor, they uh, make rocket stoves and they talk about how wonderful their rocket stoves are. And their rocket stoves are wonderful. There's a lot of videos on YouTube about it. But they, uh, on their website, they kind of put down home-built rocket stoves and, wow. And uh, they say that they've never tested a uh, homemade rocket stove that could boil the five liters of water in it. Like this one can. And definitely never test anything made in the USA that could do it. So, guys, uh, I'm doing this video to show you that you don't need to be put off by what these people, you know, not everything you read on the internet is true, obviously, or this would not work, this proof of concept. Now, I tried, this is just a scrap, I tried blocking that off and the flames went down and I tried cramming the firebox full and that, that didn't get me the results I'm getting right now. I did have a lid on it, uh, like I said, this... Uh, this is for another project here at a future date. But this thing is kicking butt and taking names. Now, um, I did a preliminary burn which did really good. I think I got a gallon boiling in seven minutes. Uh, now, like I said, guys, this, this is uh, 1.3 gallons here. But I, I got it to boil, a rolling boil in seven minutes, and I, it wasn't, it was just tacked and tacked together, and the air was going in there, and it really worked well. I just kind of just tacked this together here, as you can see. I welded it and it didn't seem to do as well as it's doing right now so that's where you see those little um, secondary burn air holes if that's the correct thing to call it but it is you can see it is definitely kicking butt no skirt and we have done what they say a certain manufacturer says that they've never seen it before so you've seen it here first on YouTube a home built rocket stove that can boil the uh, five liters of water or 1.3 gallons and this is just uh, pallet wood I've got right here I think this is a piece of split oak there was one piece I put in there of that but mainly that's just done out of pallet wood and it is raging you can hear this thing you can hear that I want to say that I watched a boatload of rocket stove videos out there guys to make this and I, I appreciate everybody who uh, added something to it um, I want to say that what really motivated me was reading that website saying that uh, you know this this you know home home backyard rocket stoves you know don't work and you know they can't they can't boil that much water and all that. So needless to say, I was uh, very uh, inspired to make it happen. And in case you're curious, that is uh, six by six by three sixteenths box steel tubing. As a matter of fact, that's what that is right there. All right, guys, I'm going to attempt the water bowl test. Let's see, we got, um, I guess that's about 445 or so. And I got my 5 liters of water in there. And we'll see if it'll boil it and how long it will take. And I don't have a skirt or anything or any insulation to put around it. So let's just see what it'll do. All right, we're about, I guess about, what's that, six minutes into it can see those little bubbles down there starting to form. So it is boiling in about six minutes. So let's, uh, let's see if we can get it to a rolling boil. How long that will take. Okay guys, I guess we're about 13 minutes into it. And it's not exactly a rolling boil, but is boiling the water and I am very confident 
that if this had a skirt on it, it would boil a lot quicker than that. And I changed up from uh, this pot right here because that, that's all that holds right there is like a gallon and a half and it starts boiling and it starts getting all over the place. So, five liters in about 13 minutes. Not the best boil I've ever seen, but it is boiling. So, I just need to do a couple improvements and I think we can uh, definitely do a little bit better. So, okay. Homestead prepper out. Alright, there we go. There's a rolling boil. Alright, what's that? Well, I guess that's about 15 minutes. Okay. Well, 15 minutes, guys. The uh, the competitor, they do it in 13 minutes, but they use a skirt. So I guess what I need to do is get a skirt and see if we can get that time down a little bit better than that. Oh, yeah. That's what we want. That is really raging. Okay. All right. Said it couldn't be done. There it is. Well, I take that back. They said they just never seen it done. Alright. Homestead Prepper 